A man from Luzerne County has gone viral, and it's for his own obituary. Kevin McGrory passed away Tuesday at his home in West Pittston. But since his death, the legacy he leaves behind has his friends saying, that's the Kevin we knew. Newswatch 16's Jackie DeTore caught up with some of McGrory's friends today. Jackie, this one showed up my newsfeed, and I shared it too. Yeah, almost everyone has seen it because Kevin McGordy's obituary was first published on Friday. Now, you may have seen it because, like Jim said, people have been sharing it all over social media. That's because the 53-year-old wrote his own obituary with his own twisted sense of humor. We spoke with the Luzerne County Natives friends to find out the real story of the man behind the hilarious obit. Friends describe Kevin McGordy as the life of the party, but now thousands of people are just getting to know him. Kevin was fun. Everything about him was fun. McGordy died at his home in West Pittston on Tuesday, but his death has people talking because McGordy wrote his own obituary, starting with the line, McGordy achieves room temperature. Online comments on the obituary and people saying, I wish I knew this guy. I'm sorry for anybody who didn't because to know him was really to love him. Brian Langan knew McGrory since kindergarten and he has a lifetime of memories to share. With his passing, I'm very, very sad, but I'm, I'm uh, preoccupied mainly with, wow, everybody else is getting to know him. Uh, I'm a little bit scared too because I'm thinking he's gone. I know all these stories and he was the only one that could back him up. McGordy doesn't leave behind any children, but he does still have a legacy. For instance, this Mona Lisa painting in downtown Pittston. And his friends also say the bigger legacy he'll leave behind, all the stories they have to tell. He just stood up in that voice and, and command the whole bus. Bus driver, slow down. It scares me when the birds fly backwards. And from then on, the whole bus had his attention and he played them like a piano. McGordy ended his obituary with some smart advice, saying it costs nothing to be nice and never stick a steak knife in an electrical outlet. But his friends don't think that's his last word. Not at all. I, I expected this. I expected more. And I'm still not sure if, if there's not more to pop up. Uh, I, I really wouldn't be surprised at all. You want a peppercini? I got a peppercini. I'm Papa Luigi. Friends will say goodbye to Kevin McGordy tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. at the St. Cecilia Church. Now, according to McGordy's obituary, that's following a brief rant of how the government screwed up all the Bugs Bunny cartoons trying to censor violence. His friends tell News Watch 16 they expect people who never even knew the Luzerne County native to show up tomorrow and pay their respects for the funny man. Now, obviously, these people are very upset that they're no, he's no longer with us, but his legacy is living on and so many people are getting to know him now. Yeah, and I think it was his full intention to get that last laugh, Jackie. Oh yeah, he won this one. Yeah, he did. <laughs> Thank you so much. Great story.